Hello crafters, this is Yana Smakula. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have something slightly different to share with you, a holiday card making kit. I am personally not really a card kit kind of person as I like the freedom I have when I pick my own products, you know, like dies and stamps and things like that. But once in a while, I love using card making kits because they make it so very easy to make beautiful cards. I especially like the Christmas card kits because, well, I never have enough Christmas cards, but also because I just love Christmas in general. You know, I love Christmas decor. I love looking at Christmas inspiration online. I love shopping for Christmas, even though I already have all the Christmas decorations I can possibly want. So really, anything Christmas, I am game. The kit that I'm showing you today is the brand new limited edition Santa Lane kit from Spellbinders. A limited edition means that once this kit sells out, it will not be restocked. So it is one time only. I do recommend this kit either for yourself or as a gift for a friend. The friend doesn't have to be a crafty friend. You know, uh, it can be a gift for someone you may be one to introduce into the world of crafting. Spellbinders had a similar kit last year. It was amazing. I don't remember if I did a video using it. I think I planned to do a video, but then I ran out of time. Anyhow, what I'm trying to say is that I love that kit. I used it. I made a bunch of cards using it, but I also later gifted, uh, gifted it to a friend who is brand new to crafting and she hasn't made a card in her life, but she's seen my cards and she has been very much fascinated by card making in general. And even though I gave her basically a used kit, she loved it so much. And she was like a kid on Christmas morning. She couldn't wait to take it home and play and maybe, you know, share it with her nieces and create some cards. She was just so excited. The kit this year, this kit is even better. It is so big and there are so many pieces to the kit. There are even add-ons that you can get separately if, you know, for some reason you feel like you don't have enough products in the kit or maybe if you ran out of some products and want to get multiples. First of all, the kit comes with a mix of card base sizes. So you have the five by seven card bases and envelopes and also a two card bases in envelopes. I think there is a total of 25 card bases so you can easily make 25 cards. You can make more because you also have additional card stock that you can cut and fold into card bases. I'm sharing 10 card ideas or card designs in this video. And if you search on YouTube, you can find other videos by other designers featuring this kit to get even more card design ideas. Or, you know, you can get creative and design your own cards. It is very easy. The contents of the kit, they all coordinate and it just makes it very easy to create. So you have a pattern paper. There are two sheets of each design. Some designs are foiled. So that's a nice bonus. You, you guys know me, you know that I love anything foiled. You also have loads of die cuts. And again, some of these die cuts have foiled accents to them and you get two of each designs. You have stickers, you know, regular stickers, puffy stickers, sentiment stickers, glitter stickers, foil stickers, you name it. You even have a bag of sequins and some very sparkly gems. Obviously, I'm not giving you a very proper description of the kit contents, but hopefully you can see on the screen everything that you are getting. Now, there's also a pretty big die set included in this kit, and that makes a Santa. Again, the die, the finished die cut is quite large. It's perfect for five by seven cards, but can also be adapted to smaller A2 cards. And you also have a stamp set to stamp some holiday imagery and stamp some sentiments. And there's even a pack of cardstock with different color cardstock that coordinates with everything else in this kit. And for metallic cardstock sheets, you have two gold and two silver, and these are absolutely perfect. So it is a very beefy kit. You do get a lot inside the box. It makes a great gift for a friend or a great gift for yourself. It would also make a fun event piece. You know, if you wanted to have your crafty girlfriends over, you can get the kid, get some wine and make some cards. 
Here's a look at the dies that come with the kit. Now I've die cut all of the pieces. You can pause this part of the video and take note of what needs to be cut from which color of cardstock as at first, when you just look at that die set, it is a little bit confusing since you have so many different pieces. Now I'm not going to show you how to assemble this die set. You can watch that on the Spellbinders YouTube channel. I did a video for them showing how to assemble everything. Now for my cards, I did simple design for each card. So I have a sheet of pattern paper covering the front of an A2 card base. So all of my cards are A2. Uh, I am an A2 size kind of a card maker. I rarely make five by seven cards. And if you are like me, if you prefer the A2 size, you can use the five by seven card bases in the kit and just trim them down to A2 size. And you'll have yourself 25 A2 card bases to work with. The envelopes, of course, will be for the five by seven cards, but maybe you can put the, you know, the more dimensional cards in the five by seven envelopes. I'm going to play some music and show you the process video for the 10 cards. The assembly is very simple. Now, in some cases, I adhered some of the die cuts or some of the stickers to white cardstock. You'll see me do that. And I did that to back the stickers or the die cuts up to make them a little bit more sturdy. I popped many of the elements up on my cards and I used either foam adhesive that comes with a kit or foam squares from my stash. And for that, I needed the die cuts to be a little bit more sturdy. As always, I have links to the card kit and also to the add-ons and the other products that I feature in this video linked in my video description below and also in the coordinating blog post over on my blog. Now there are also timestamps if you want to jump to a specific card in this video.
I hope you find this video useful and I hope you feel inspired to create. Thanks so much for joining me today. Love you guys and I'll see you next time.